Hello, hello, hello. This is Suzanne Sellers, your favorite global traveler. I am owner of Suzy D Travel LLC based in Chicago. Today is Saturday, July 4th, 2020, and I'm here at the lovely El Dorado Maroma Beach Resort in Riviera Maya. I wanted to talk about the COVID protocols that are in place at the Cancun International Airport, which is where I landed on yesterday morning, and here at the El Dorado Maroma Resort. Before departing on my flight from Chicago, I had to complete an online travel authorization form. When I purchased my flight, the airline sent me an email stating that I needed to fill out a form. I wasn't aware of the form. I had been researching COVID protocols and requirements for visitors and entry uh, online and had not yet seen the requirement for the form. However, the airline did inform me and I'm grateful for that. So when they sent the, e after I purchased the ticket to Cancun, they sent me an email saying, you need to fill out this form. So I filled out the form online and when I filled out the form, I was approved and I got a, uh, a barcode. I was sent a barcode from the Mexican government or Mexican Mexico uh, Customs and Im Immigrations, I guess, or maybe it's their health authority. I'm not sure who issues the code, but I received a code in my email and I was told to present the code to the gate attendants at the airline, which I did and i was approved to get on the plane i flew here i flew to cancun i had an overnight stop in dallas and i went from dallas to cancun on early morning very early morning saturday i mean i'm sorry friday july 3rd which was yesterday when i arrived at cancun international airport it was packed three airplanes full of people all landed at virtually the same time and I was on one of them. So that means the Customs and Immigration Hall at the Cancun International Airport was very full. There were several lines and all of the lines were snaked around several times through the ropes. And I would say I had to wait about almost 30 minutes before I got up to the Customs and Immigration uh, Specialist for the Mexico government in the Mexico Airport Authority. They checked my airport and asked me a couple of questions, stamped my, pa um, no, they checked my passport, asked a couple of questions, stamped my passport with the Mexico uh, stamps and allowed me to leave and proceed. I went outside, I went to my arranged transportation. The El Dorado Maroma Resort has a contract with uh, Lomas Travel, L-O-M-A-S uh, Transportation, and uh, they directed me to how to find them. I found them outside. They were holding up a sign with my name and I went to them and they arranged for my ride. They gave me, the Lomas uh, transportation people gave me a hand sanitizer several times uh, before I was able to even get into the shuttle van to be taken to my resort. They explained to me uh, what the ride would be like, how long the resort, uh, how far the resort was from the airport. And uh, they introduced me to my driver and there were two other people in the van. They only have three to four people per van and the van I think can fit about 15 people. So I think that was good. They were uh, definitely practicing social distancing. The Lomas uh, transportation people were very nice. They all had on uh, face masks. We, the riders had on face masks and uh, everything was fine. I got here to El Dorado Maroma Resort. I was asked, uh, they have, and which I like, at the entrance of every door of every common area, they have three different mats. The first mat is a mat that is wet. And you step on that mat, then you step on another mat 
to dry your feet and then you step on another mat before to walk into any common area you're walking into. And so I went into the reception area of the Odoardo Maroma Resort. I was immediately given hand sanitizer. Uh, all of the staff had on mask in the reception area. I had on my mask. I, I like another thing that I like is they all of the sign in process, the check in process is electronic and it's from your phone, not their equipment. They send you, they give you a code on a piece of paper and you scan that code with your phone. And when you do, a check in form pops up on your phone so you can do all of your own signing in. And it's a touchless process between you and the receptionist who is checking you in. I thought that was very innovative and very creative and, and I felt safe and I was glad that they had that. I also noticed that they had the same check-in process at the excursions desk when I went today to do excursions. They are enforcing social distancing here at El Dorado, El Dorado Maroma. It is a, a large, fairly large resort. Uh, there are three El Dorado properties by Charisma here in the Riviera Maya area. I am at the largest one, I believe. I am at the one that has the beach, the white sand beach, beautiful, right on the Caribbean Sea. I have a beautiful suite and uh, it is huge. I have a swim up suite and uh, everything everything is uh, sanitized, pristine and clean. So I have had a great time here. No, there was not any COVID test done uh, at the airport or here at the resort. Uh, they, are, they do ask a questionnaire. When I was checking in here at El Dorado Maroma, that code that pops up the check-in form, it asks a series of COVID-related questions and I answered the questions honestly. And they have taken my temperature a couple of times at the excursions area and at the uh, spa. I had the spot today and they took my temperature there and asked COVID related questions and I had to sign a COVID uh, waiver or something. And, but other than that, uh, I do feel safe. I feel safe. I feel um, protected. I do feel that uh, they have put protocols in place to protect their guests and I'm having a great time. Thank you. If you have any questions, please let me know. And. I am a travel agent, owner of Suzy D Travel. If you would like to experience Riviera Maya for yourself, please feel free to book with me, Suzy D. My toll-free telephone number is 833-SUZY D. That's 833-S-U-Z-Y-D-E-E. -E. And the, the numbers behind that is 833-789-789. 9333. You can also email me, suzyd at suzydtravel.com. Thanks. Bye.